beer that made this city famous, but who knows, before all is said and done, it could be this developing rivalry between the Milwaukee Bucks and the Toronto Raptors. Is that the Raptors start to get some high quality shots. Field goal percentage is key in this ballgame. Carter with his first points of the game. And Vince can make that shot, obviously. He is improved. Michelle going hard to the basket, couldn't get it to drop, and Carter comes back. We got four on three now. And there's Carter. With Vince Carter making a good decision. You stay with the basketball. The Ronald will be happy if that's the kind of shot that Milwaukee gets. And gets Vince with. heating it up. There's six points. I'll tell you, Carter just continues to impress with his outside shooting. And one of the things Carter has six points. By half court, try to get the ball out of Cassell's hands. Scooped it back, but lost it. And yes, he can. Vince Carter, since Carter was alone in the open court, he's going to take a warm up for the slam dunk contest at the All Star game. Vince Carter. To go in the first quarter. Here's the highlight from the first quarter Carter all alone just flies. Folks just wasn't going to get it over Manning there. But Carter is hot. Oh, he is cooking so far. There's Carter. Oh, there's Vince Carter again, up for the second time. Down court for a great shot. Hook. Grady with oh. a nice try, and Carter there to follow up. But Grady went hard to the basket here. Vince Carter, nobody finds Vince, but Grady goes up hard, leaves the ball on the rim, and Vince Carter gets the offensive rebound and dunks it home for two points. Carter, nice little dribble move, turns and fires. And Carter with two more. 20 points. He had 18 after those two. Oh. And the third effort, Carter finally gets it. Well, Vince Carter. Order. And look at Carter, as you said, just plowing his way through this second half. Carter with a big two. Well, Vince Carter continues to find with the ball. He wants to get all the way to the goal, can't quite get there, but has the nice soft touch. The ball hangs around the rim and drops through. Butch Carter beside himself. Vince Carter probably a little more cheery. He's with Paul Jones. All right, guys, Vince, the 10th 30-point game for you. That's a, a franchise record, but I know you want to talk about the key assist and the key block. Tell me about those two plays. Well, I was trying to get to the hole to either get fouled, get an easy basket, or find the open man. Well, got to the basket, and I didn't get fouled, and, 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 I, and I could see Dell over there. He was wide open. He, I, he had his hands ready, so I believe in him. You kind of expect that, though, the way the game was. It was very rough. You weren't getting a lot of calls going to the hoop consistently. But what does a game like this, a win like this, mean to your team, especially in light of the rivalry that's developing? Experience for the playoffs. Uh, if we get there, we'll have some experience, and we'll be prepared, and we'll understand how the game played and what we need to do to win the game. All right, Vince, good luck. We'll see you next week in Oakland. Thank you. Seventh double-double year for Vince, and a big win for the Raptors. Vince Carter is our Amex player of the game. Had a great first quarter and then finished strongly in the fourth. You know, he plays with the heart of a champion here. He understands when he has a mismatch situation right there, uses his skill to get the turnaround jump shot. Then he gets down inside on the glass, working hard, comes back and tucks it off the glass for two. So the Raptors pick up a big win over the Milwaukee Bucks. They split the season series two games apiece.